Hello everyone. So today we will see how to create secret manager of AWS using Terraform. So basically AWS secret manager is a fully managed service provided by Amazon Web Services. So if you have the uh, sensitive information, so you can use this AWS secret manager to store your API keys, database passwords and other credentials. So let's see the benefits of it. Centralized management keeps everything in one organized location. So you don't need to go uh, and to, uh, to give your time to another services. Everything, whatever your credentials, you will store at a one organized location, a one hard code. So rather than putting passwords and keys directly in your code, you fetch them securely from secrets manager. So with the help of the AWS uh, secrets manager, you don't need to put your passwords and users in your code, you can uh, securely secure it or you can store it in the secrets manager. Easy updates. If your secrets change, you can update them in one place and applications automatically get the latest version. So you don't need and uh, you have to don't need to go over there and update. It will get update automatically. Next is security features. Provides additional security features like automatic rotation of secrets and access control making sure only authorized entities can access the secrets. So with the help of this feature, that is automatic rotation, you can uh, you don't have the same permanent password or the access key, whatever you may call it, it will always rotate. So you can refer this article on our official page of DevOps team. Now we will go to the uh, official page of AWS. Here you can see that with the help of the secrets manager, uh, the application is over here and the KMS key, that is key management service with the help of this AWS KMS key, you can access your uh, other sensitive information. And this service is applicable to Amazon RDS, Amazon Redshift, Amazon Document Database. And if you want to use this service for other than these services, you have to get the help of the uh, AWS Lambda service also. Now, we will go and see how to use this service in our Terraform. So, let's go to our article here. You will need first uh, the user created in your management console, uh, which have the access key and secret access key. And you have to just copy this syntax. Uh, where we, have, we are going to create the AWS KMS key then a secret manager secret and then the secret manager secret version all these three will be uh, going to create and here the rotation time we have enabled the rotation true means we have going to provide the rotation and the uh, deletion window for this uh, secret will be seven days so let's copy this syntax And now you can see I have created the secrets manager folder in desktop. Now right click on it and I will open it with my Visual Studio code. And here I have created the secrets.tf file. So I will just remove this syntax from here. And I will copy the syntax which we have copied from the our article and I will save it. Okay, so I have saved the syntax. Now, let's open the terminal. So now we are in the desktop and we are in the folder secrets manager. Now let's give the command Terraform initialize and let's check whether our syntax 
it's correct or not okay so dear here, here message is displayed like error form has been successfully initialized now we will go for the second command of terraform plan now let's see what we are going to create okay so in plan you can see three to add what they three to add mean here the first one we will uh, the terraform will create the aws kms key then it will create the aws secret manager secret then it will create the secret manager secret version okay so now we will provide the command terraform apply we have to wait till the apply get completed so now you have to press the yes type yes and hit the enter button now you can see the kms key is going to create its a secret version is going to create and secret credentials is going to create so it will create after 5 seconds so let's wait it's still in creating mode So you can see it's taking a time. We have to wait till it get created. It's taking more time. Let's see why it's taking too much time, but we have to wait till it get created. Okay, so you can see the error is over here. It's saying that with this name already, I have created one demo, one uh, AWS secret manager, and it is in still deletion process. So I have to change the demo credentials name over here. Okay, so this type of mistake may happen with you also. So let's go to our syntax. And here they have mentioned on line number 11. So on line number 11. Okay, so I will give this name as demo 1. Okay. And here I will mention as demo 1. Everywhere I will change as demo 1. In description also in KMS key also. Now let's check. I have created a demo. I have replaced demo with demo one everywhere or not. Okay. Everything looks good. Now we will save this. And again, we will initialize. Now let's see of a service get created or not. Let's plan the 
syntax. Okay, I made the mistake, same mistake again. I forgot to change the KMST ID as they move one. So here in the line, I have to enter the one. Now let's again save the syntax. Let's create with the initialize command. I hope this time our syntax is uh, ready to create. Now let's hit the red terraform plan command. Okay, now we are good to go to create our syntax. So let's see, it will create the secret manager secret. Then again, KMST. Now let's give the command Terraform apply. Enter the value as is. Okay. So you can see the demo one is going to create and the application apply complete. Sorry, apply is complete. Now we will go to management console. And here we will see the demo one credentials is created. So in this way, we have created the AWS secret manager using Terraform.